comedy show that I was fortunate to be a part of in Living Cover it is about to celebrate its 25th anniversary, and I'm thrilled to welcome the man behind some of the show's funniest moments. Please welcome the dear Tommy Davidson. Yeah. Saturday Night Live, it kind of like was doing this thing here. And all of us were like, uh, Keenan was like Professor Xavier, you know, for the X-Men. He like found us, put us together. We were like comedy mutants. And he was like, just like he was just like, I'm the beast, by the way. And we just, we just went at him. But the thing about it was we were really funny. Like, we really love comedy. We watched people like her, you know? And, um, yeah. Auditioning process. You already said that you met the Wayne brothers. Right. You were known for really doing stand up before right. you got your big right. break. So, how did it come about? It was a little scary. Uh, uh, I had met Keenan. He had, he, he had done a movie called I'm going to Get You Sucker. And I oh, met him baby. there. Yeah. Yeah. Tell you. Huge movie. You know? Hilarious. And I was like, hey, how you doing? He was like, I heard of you. You know? And he was like, you're really, really funny. I want you to come in for the show. So, when I went in for the show, the improv was the first thing to do. Now, I had never done improv, I had done it at my house when I was a kid. <laughs> I didn't know it was improv. My mother used to tell me, shut the hell up. So so, so I get in there, and, and this is improv, because you're a cab driver, you're Puerto Rican, you're in New York, and the person in, your, in the back seat is eating. And I'm like, you know, hey, hey, put it down, put it down, put it down, you can't eat my cab. You know, I was so, you know, I just tried, I just tried, and I walked, I walked out of there going, I don't know what I did, but then they had a stand-up audition with 30 of the hottest comedians in L.A., and I was number 30 on the list. And so, never back a chihuahua in the corner. <laughs> you know? Yeah. Yeah. So, I got a standing ovation, and the rest was history. Yeah, yeah the rest yeah, was history. Yeah. Oh, now, yeah. you were known for a lot of great characters on the show. <laughs> but, we love your impersonations. Can you, like, do a little something for us? Do you have a um, scene that we like? Please, we'll see. Oh, yes. well, well, that's that's probably the easiest one, Rose. Um, <laughs> They say some people long ago were looking for some brand new news, one that they can use like no other. So they stay. <laughs> as a kid? Oh, was I? I mean, I, I would do impressions. I, I didn't know there were impressions then. I'd do Al Jarreau, you know, boom, boom, bam, bam, bam. And my mother would like, would you be quiet? And then one time she saw Al Jarreau on TV and she was like, do that again? 
you know, so I always had that knack to do yeah. it. I'm like a computer. It's like, right. if I see it, I can do, do it. it. Yeah. All yeah. right, so now you're doing, you're doing a movie in Toronto, uh -huh. and you're also doing a one-man show? Yeah. I've inspired been working, by like, anybody, maybe? Inspired by this one right here. <laughs> by this yeah. one. What? Yeah. A British guy comes to America, his mom marries a dude in Detroit. You can imagine where it goes from there. Yeah, and yeah. we love you. I, I, I hope you come back. You are one of the funniest people. I'm so happy for you. Oh, thanks to Tommy Davidson. Be sure to get Tommy Davidson.